Hey, Todd here reviewing another Simi Valley parking lot in my uh, special series, uh, Spiritual Parking Lots, or uh, the Church Parking Lots of Simi Valley. Um, uh, today, I'm uh, on Erringer Road uh, at a place called the Center for Spiritual Living. Um, I'm not sure if it's a church. Blurs! There's, it looks like there's some kind of religious center. It looks honestly like more like a strip mall. And there's also a, there's a dentist's office and a kid's school. And, and here's the thing. So there's entry points on uh, Ar Erringer and on the side street uh, near this place. Um, I can't see the street sign, so I don't know what the hell it's called. Sorry, you're going to have to look that up on your own. Uh, the point is, is it's uh, hard to figure out where the parking lot for this place is. Um, and, and the spaces that are right next to the place are, um, they're very exclusive. It's, you know, private parking. Uh, you can't park here unless you're going to school or the dentist. Uh, what about the people at the spiritual center? How Where are they supposed to go well I guess the answer is in the uh, adjacent parking lot for the strip mall next to the uh, spiritual living center um, which is where I'm at right now Blurshy. Um the, the blacktops actually in great shape it's beautiful blacktop the lines are uh, painted there they could probably use a, a fresh coat but they're still in good shape uh, the spaces are ample um, uh, yeah, I mean, the parking lot itself is actually pretty great. It's just confusing as to who's supposed to park where, and the access points are confusing. I had to drive around the block. I missed entirely the parking lot the first time. It, it, that's what I'm saying. I mean, it, it's location, location, location. And this parking lot is not located well for people who want to be at a spiritual center. Sorry. Blue she This has been a Blursh production. Blur.